Hello, hello you people in YouTube land, how do you do? So, yes, you guessed it, looking for food. Where? Hmm. Yeah, where? Just, I don't know, like, maybe I'm just looking for a sign to tell me where to go to eat. Hmm. Yep, I think I found the sign. The sign points to this direction. And we are going to this place. Yes, this place behind the fence. Cooked. You know it. Havelock Road Cooked Food Centre. Yes. So this is the food centre. A L-shaped food centre. Yep. Havelock Road Cooked Food Centre. 22 A and 22 B. Be here to eat the food. Or watch me eat the food. Well, I guess that's what this video is, isn't it? Ooh. Okay, so we're gonna head in here and see what we can find. So we're coming to this place called Convent Gardens Prawn Noodle. Yep, so we're gonna come here and get some prawn noodle. So I got some prawn noodle. Uh, they asked me what kind of noodle I want. So I decided to get the yellow noodles or yellow meat. You can get bihun or other ingredients. I also get some chili powder. I also ordered the, the dry version, spicy. And look at it. So this is my, I guess, meal, my breakfast. What I'm going to eat, what I'm going to makan. Yes. So this is it. The prawn noodle and the soup. Yep, a small bowl of soup together with my dry prawn noodle. So this is it. So I think we should... Uh, let's see what's in there first, okay? So since this is prawn noodle, there should be prawn in there. You can see prawn. Some slices of, I think, bean pork. Noodles. Yep, yellow noodles. Bean sprouts in there too. I think some dried shallots. Yep. Oh, yep, yep. And my favorite, you know it, pork lard. I think some fish cake too, if I'm not mistaken. Mm. Yep. Dried, uh, fried shallots, pork lard. Ooh. Looks like quite a bit of pork lard. Some bean sprouts. Okay, that's it. That's the soup. Ooh, looks quite cloudy. So this soup here, I think, is some kind of like you know the um, they cook the prawns in there to get all the flavor into the soup. That's how it looks like it. So we should give it a try. So first thing is we need to mix the noodles. Uh, get all the sauce, coat all the noodles nicely. Yep. Effort. I am doing a lot of mixing. I don't know, no, but recently, recently, I find that in a lot of my videos, I am mixing a lot. I wonder why. Because mixing is an important uh, activity for eating good food. At least I assume so. Yep, the noodles looks like it's well mixed. Look at that. Dry at the bottom, which is good. Now we just get a nice mouthful and taste the noodles. Oh, yep. That looks like a big enough mouthful. Mm. Oh, yep. Oop, yup, 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 yup. My mouth is full of noodles. The noodles here. Mm, okay, nice and chewy. I like the texture of the noodles. Nicely flavored too, spicy. Good flavors in the noodles. The noodles here, they do it quite well. But let's just taste some of the soup, man. One thing about prawn noodles, one of the main features of the dish is the soup. Mmm. 
the soup is not bad. A nice prawn flavor there, savory, mm. good, nice flavor there. But what I do really like is the, yeah, my favorite part of the noodles, the pork lard. Looks good. Mmm, tastes good too. One thing I do like about the noodles here, the noodles here does, they put a lot of the uh, oil, uh, pork lard oil into the noodles, so the noodles here, it is actually quite flavorful. And then over here is the prawn. Okay, okay, the prawn is nice and fresh. They actually cut it in half, they debate it, they deshell it, so very easy to eat. What else is there? Let's see. Oh, fish cake. Yep, fish cake, quite normal. Now, what else do we have here? Oh, yeah, the lean meat. Box slices. Oh okay. Oh, not too bad. I like the I like it that the pork slices are nice, soft and tender. Bean sprouts also slightly crunchy. So overall, overall, noodle flavored well. Definitely got a bit of the pork lard flavor there. Yeah, add in some more chili if you like it spicy. Add in more chili and mix it up. So the noodle itself is uh, spicy, uh, savory, a bit of a prawny flavor. I also I think a bit of the pork lard flavor too. Noodles are uh, slightly soft but also still nice and chewy too. Yep. Definitely seasoned with the chili powder. Okay lah, okay lah. The chili powder doesn't really add extra flavor to the noodles. Make it slightly more spicy but other than that, I think don't need to put the powder also okay. Just eat it originally by this. Okay, now what I do like to do, you know me, I do like to make a huge, 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 huge mouthful uh, with a bit of everything on it. Look at it, the prawn, fish cake, pork lard, noodle, beans, sprouts, and more pork lard. Yep. Oh, yep. Yep, definitely, definitely a big mouthful. Oh, yeah. Going to enjoy this. Oh. So big that I could almost, almost not fit it into my mouth, man. Definitely, definitely. Mm, that is good. That, that, that is good. All the flavors there. Yep. Surprisingly, surprisingly, I think the store here does make some really good corn noodles. So far here, the soup is good. The noodles are good. The flavors are nice and strong and a bold and nice. Mm. Yep. People say that this is the old school taste, and the store has been around for quite a while. I think uh, probably sixty years or something like that. But overall, overall, I think they do the noodles here well. I do like the flavors here. A surprising lah. No, I mean, uh, coming to this small food center in the middle of some neighborhood area. A small food center too. You know, normally you should normally maybe find one or two good stalls that, that sells good food. But here, quite a few stalls here do the food quite well. Yep. So, yep. Definitely, definitely, I do like it. And yes, finally, I know those are all done. But still, a bit left, a bit of the pork lard left. Oh yeah. Now I will just slowly enjoy. Yep. Mm. Definitely, definitely good. I do like my pork lard. But, still got the soup. Like I said, don't waste a single drop. Drink it, drink it until everything, everything, everything is gone. Like how it is now. See, bowl empty, bowl empty. The bowl of the noodles, the bowl of the soup. All empty, all in my tummy. I'm very satisfied and, yep, that's it. Unfortunately, unfortunately, fortunately, unfortunately, this, this, yes, this brings us to the end of our food adventure here. Uh, unfortunately. 
So as per usual, you know what to do. Like, share and subscribe. Yes, subscribe. Like and share. Because that really helps my channel a lot to grow. Without that, you know. Yeah. Anyway, so as per usual, don't forget to join me for my next adventure. My next food adventure. Yes, the food adventure. Yep. So uh, see you guys around. Guys, gals and others too. Bye-bye.